Well, hello, everybody. I hope you're having a great day. Take a look at this beautiful, fresh corn on the cob. I want to show you the easiest and the fastest way to make this. Now, I saw this demonstrated on YouTube, and I just had to try it. And for just demonstration purposes, I'm only going to make one ear. You take it just as it is with no preparation, and you put it in the microwave just like this. Simple. And then we want to cook it on high for five minutes. And you need to add more time if you have more corn. And after the five minutes is up, you go ahead and just take it out. And you have to be really careful because it's going to be extremely hot. Now, don't knock this method until you try it. I was a skeptic, and that's why I wanted to try it. And it worked so well, I just have to share it with you. I'll put a link. Uh, to the other YouTube video where I saw it first done this way. But anyway, you want to take it out and let it rest for at least a minute. Check it and see if it's uh, cool enough to handle. It's still pretty hot. And then you take a knife and you cut the stalk end. And you want to get at least one row of actual corn and cut it off. And uh, cut it just like that. No problem at all. You can see the corn there. And then you just gently squeeze it out. I know it just it seems odd, but one of the uh, biggest hassles about corn on the cob is shucking it and then dealing with all the corn silk. And if you've ever done it, you know what I mean. This is absolutely the easiest way to cook corn. And it is so simple, it's, uh, it almost seems like a magic trick. And you gently push it. You, you take your time and let it come out at its own speed. You don't want to rush it. And then it comes out just like that. Isn't that amazing? Look how beautiful that is. We'll go ahead and cut this in two. But I, I'll tell you what. I'm still just surprised at how easy this method is. And I'm going to go ahead and plate this up. Now, I really want to thank a good friend of mine that I uh, just uh, gave me some corn, and I'm uh, going to go and put some, of course, some butter on it. You can prepare your corn the way you like it. Some people cut it off the cob, and some eat it on the cob. I like it either way, but I certainly like it with butter. And uh, just put some butter on there, and then and get ready to enjoy it. Now, it was in the microwave for five minutes. I let it rest for one minute, and then you saw me take it out. And so we're looking at under ten minutes from start to buttering the corn. Now where I live, the best sweet corn comes from Esau. This is Esau corn out of Dumas, Arkansas, and you probably have some uh, places to get the best kind of fresh corn, and I recommend you get the best corn available to you. And we want to put a little salt on there, and I like a little pepper as well, so I'll put some pepper on there. And now it's time for a taste. Oh yeah! Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Ah, oh, delicious. Well, there you have it. Simple, fast, and easy, fresh corn on the cob. Doesn't get much better than that. I hope you give this a try. Don't knock it until you try it. Anyway, thanks for watching. Take care. We'll see you next time. Bye now.